Hey everyone, welcome to Hack Earth. Today, I'm going to show you how the phishing attacks works and how the hackers can steal your credentials using a suspicious link and malicious link sent through any medium. Okay, so let's get started. First of all, I have just created some demos I'm going to show you and today we are going to use the G Fisher tool. I'm not going to show you exactly how we are going to do it, but you can see the demo, how the malicious link works and how the credential can be stolen using a suspicious link or a website. Okay, let's get started. First of all, I have just created a demo page let me show you this is the demo page which I have created in the HTML file okay and when a user gets and malicious links they'll be redirected to some kind of this kind of page or some kind of other page in which you need to ask to uh, login and login will be authorized from the google facebook or any other mode so i'll show you when you click on this button login let me side by side just open my terminal so that you can see how the credential can be stolen. I have already activated the Gfisher tool. When I click on login, when you get this link and click on this suspicious link, the login button, which is when you click on this login button, as you can see, the hackers will get your IP address that this is the victim IP address. In my case, I'm using the local host. I'm not creating a uh, exact link here. So it is showing me 127.0.0.1. And when I click and enter my credentials here, let me just okay as soon as i click on sign in button all the credentials will be sent to the hacker and how you can identify this is a malicious link so all you need to do is to check the url if you check the url you will find whether this is in an original official site or it is in a fake website okay so this is how you need to save yourself and when you click on sign in button you'll see that you will be redirecting to the main google page so and all the account details the credential of the account will be sent to the hacker directly the hacker get your account name and, and the password directly and the victim won't be able to know that they have been hacked the credential has been stolen so this is the thing which is going around the world and you need to be save yourself and how you can save yourself you can save yourself by just looking the url if you check the url while before entering the ex your credentials login credential you will be safe okay so that's it for now today and today uh, we are using the gfizer tool which is easily available and this is the most dangerous tool which is currently used by the most of the hackers to steal your credentials through the social engineering if you want me to tell you about the social engineering and how it's work, please write in the comment box and 
and comment like this video and share and subscribe this channel so that i can be i can create more and more videos like this and we are also starting the python tutorial c tutorial c++ tutorial and go language tutorial for the hacking ethical hacking purpose so that you can create your own tools to test your own skills not for the hacking because hacking is strictly illegal if you are using to check your own project you can use it but not on the internet and not to fool someone or to steal credential or gain someone's access this is how i have shown you this is how the zfisher tool works and the phishing works and if somebody wants this page this html file you can get it from the github i'll post the link of the this repository in the description box you can get this link okay so that's for that's all for it today we'll i'll see you in the next video with something amazing and something new is coming so please subscribe this channel so that you can get more and more interesting videos like hacking and how you can save yourself from the hacking and test your knowledge without harming anyone thank you very much